I'm Spider with today I'm going to be talking about things in Halloween surprises. Well, maybe if you look into a mirror, you say, wow, it's so shiny. Well, the word shiny is a word that we're going to discover in this. Well, let's see. First, funny. Something's funny? I don't know. Maybe, maybe you're reading a story? I don't know. A funny story? I don't know, but some story is funny. You say, oh, the story is so funny. Or maybe you play a game of sight. Like me playing Blind Man Bob. You say, oh, this game was so fun. Well, funny is the word I'm describing about something that makes you excited, surprised, and also makes you feel happy. It makes you to smile and to laugh. That's something that's funny. Look at these two boys. I'm wondering what makes them funny. But it looks as kind of like they are fine. They are laughing, right? Well, let's see. What things can make you feel funny? Like a book? Mm. Or maybe just a movie, you know, a movie, yeah? Well, that's fun. Next, wild, like this. Glass, it can be really wild. If you are a little bit crazy, right? You take a glass bottle and you break it. You hit it on maybe a hard object like wood. It will work. That, that means that you're not wild. You can't control your emotions. You're wild. You don't care. Just do this in a ruthless way. You're wild. Next, dirty. Oh, this dirty hand. Have they played in the mud? I don't think so, but... Yeah, maybe. True, too. Because, look, all around, it's brown. I think it's mud. Maybe they go out, they play with mom, you know, but something dirty is not nice. Your mom wouldn't love you to be dirty. Nobody would like to be dirty before. Well, dirty here. This hand is a little bit dirty. You need to clean up. Maybe use some soap. Yeah. Maybe if you look at your hand like this, is it dirty? No, I don't see anything on it. But yes, it's still dirty because there's still the small viruses inside. Well, remember, just always wash your hand, even in this time, in coronavirus time, you still need to wash it. Next, neat. Oh, if you see something that's real neat, that means it's real nice. It's in its place. It's real neat. And you can easily find maybe if you have a pen no a combination of pen that'd be fine okay maybe I just have those chest things like this in the past before this bracelet is made you know all of those small pumps have go out and they're not neat but when the people put all of those pumps inside of this string, inside of this rope, it is being real neat and it doesn't come out anymore. It's real neat and you can easily see it. Just like the way that you clean your books or maybe your pencils, it's really neat to find all of those. Next, ugly. Oh, this voice is a little bit ugly. Do you know the story, The Ugly Duckling? Yeah, that is a real long story. I I bet you all know this story before. That's a really common story. Just like Little Red Riding Hood or Cinderella or Pinocchio or maybe The Little Mermaid. Maybe all of those you have read before. Or maybe Harry Potter. Yeah, those are some of the most common stories. Something ugly some, is something that's not beautiful. 
something that's kind of like it's not neat or maybe it's a bad thing. Maybe you say, oh, that girl is pretty ugly. Maybe uh, her teeth are not clean. Maybe just when she wears dirty clothes. Maybe she talks in a dirty way, I know. But many things can make us to be ugly. Yeah. Even if I look in the mirror, I still say that I'm ugly. I bet you're very beautiful. Not ugly as me. I think you'll be much more beautiful than me. Next, pretty. Oh, what do we have here? A rainbow. But this just have three colors. Do you remember all the colors in the rainbow? We have, um, I can't remember all of them in their own order, but just, just me see. Seven colors, right? We have red, orange, yellow, um, green, blue, or dark blue. I don't know how to say that. Um, and then violet. Seven colors. I didn't remember if this was blue or lingon or any kinds of colors more because there is many kinds of blue. But I don't know how to say it in English. Well, yeah. You see here is just a picture. It doesn't have two yellow clouds like this. They have white clouds. Dark. 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 If something is dark, that means it is a little bit kind of like all around you is a dark color. You can't see anything. It's really hard to find an object. Maybe you run out of electricity. Then you see all around. Maybe in the morning or maybe in the midnight. You see it's really dark in that time. If you go out, you can't even find your way when you don't use a flashlight. Well, here I have is a moon. In my place, the moon is more than full now. It looks um, kind of like what? I don't know. But it still makes the sky to be not dark. You know, let me just fix some things. I think there is something that's wrong. There you go. Um, just showing the moon outside there. Nothing else. <laughs> the moon just look like this. This is the whole moon. Maybe I can't see it now. I also like this. Oh. oh. This is the real moon. Well, my moon is just as this. Smaller. There you go. This full part. Let me fill it. And then just use some black. Oh. Oh, yeah. This is the moon in my place. How about yours? Does it look big like mine? And shiny like a diamond. Shine, you know? It's morning, wake up and shine. <laughs> yeah, that's a way that people in our country tell their children to wake up. But in my place, my mother always called with a real loud voice, like, Hey girl, wake up! She called that for thousands of times, even when I'm sitting up. I can't even believe it. Wake up. Wake up. It's the morning. Wake up and shine. But no, in my place, they just use very big materials to do all those waking ups. Well, let's go ahead. Funny. What is the opposite of funny? Where well, we're going to find the opposite words. Funny is bored. Wild. Um, 
gentle, dirty, clean, neat, messy, ugly, beautiful, or pretty. Pretty or ugly? Yeah, those are words that say dark and light, shiny and dumb. There is also many more opposite words that you can't even believe. Well, today we've learned about some of the vocabulary words that we use to describe other things. Remember, all of those are adjectives, so use them in a correct way.